In one of my previous videos, I was having some troubles using my Colorwork Chart Keeper. I purchased a new one and promised to give you my thoughts on it, and today I'm here to deliver on that promise. So let's talk about the Chart Keeper. This is the basic Chart Keeper from We Crochet. It's compact, easy to transport, and comes with four included magnets to secure your chart and keep track of your progress at the same time. You can also buy replacement magnets from the We Crochet website if you happen to lose the originals. Whilst I've been using this chart keeper for my GraphGam projects, they can be used for a range of crochet and knitting projects. So let's get into the review, starting with the pros. One of the biggest advantages of this chart keeper is its size. When opened flat, it measures 12 inches by 9 inches, which is large enough to hold a standard A4 sheet of paper. This is perfect for most graphs or charts. When folded in half, the chart keeper is compact and easy to transport for projects on the go. You can easily slip it into a project bag and take it with you wherever you go. Having a chart keeper that is both functional and easy to carry around is a game changer for those who enjoy crocheting on the go. The keeper also folds up neatly, keeping the chart secured inside so you don't have to worry about your work getting damaged or lost during transport. One of the most versatile features of this chart is that it can be used in both landscape and portrait orientations. This is a big advantage over other chart keepers that are designed for use in only one orientation, which can be frustrating when working with charts that don't fit the prescribed format. In fact, this was the exact issue I had with my previous chart keeper, which led me to search for a more flexible alternative. I found that with this chart keeper, I no longer have to worry about being limited by the orientation of my chart. Another big pro of this chart keeper is that it's very affordable, priced at just £11.51. For those of you in the US, that's around $16. This is a great price point for a functional and durable chart keeper, and is definitely a big advantage over more expensive options on the market. In addition to the affordable price point, there are also a few colour options available to choose from, so you can pick one that fits your personal style. All in all, the features included in this chart keeper make it great value for the price. It's a functional and stylish option that won't break the bank, and it's definitely worth considering for anyone in the market for a new chart keeper. Now let's talk about the cons. One downside is that it lacks rigidity when opened flat. This can make it prone to flopping around when you pick it up and causing the magnets to shift, which can lead to you losing your place in the chart. However, this issue can be easily remedied by marking off each row with a pen once it's completed, ensuring that you won't lose your place even if the chart keeper moves around. While it may not be perfect, this simple solution will help you stay on track and avoid any frustrating mistakes while working on your crochet project. Another potential drawback of the chart keeper is that the longest magnet is not long enough to cover a chart that is being worked in landscape orientation. However, this issue can be easily resolved by using a sheet of paper as a line guide under the magnet. While it may require a little bit of extra effort, using a sheet of paper under the magnet is a small price to pay for the convenience that the chart keeper provides. Finally, it's worth noting that the chart keeper does not come with a built-in stand like some other chart holders on the market. For those who prefer to have their patterns displayed in an upright angle, this may be a drawback. However, it's important to consider that previous chart holders with built-in stands often lack the versatility to work with charts in landscape format. So there you have it, my honest thoughts on the basic chart keeper from We Crochet. Overall, I'm really happy with this product, especially considering its affordability and versatility. If you're interested in learning more about crocheting with charts, be sure to check out my previous video, How to Crochet a Graphgan from Start to Finish. In that video, I take you through the process of creating a Graphgan from scratch, including how to make your own charts. If you decide to try out the basic chart keeper for yourself, let me know how you like it. I hope you found this review helpful and I will see you in the next one.